A first alert weather alert has been issued for Friday through Sunday, and it's all because of the heat. Now, we know heat. I know it's July. It's the Coachella Valley. It's going to be hot, but we are going to be dealing with dangerous conditions, not only because of the afternoon high temperatures, but also that stickiness you feel in the air. That's monsoonal moisture that's going to be staying with us through that same time frame as well. So our temperatures are going to be turning up and we're still going to be dealing with that extra humidity around. Now, an excessive heat warning has been issued. This goes into place at 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. We'll stay in place through 8 p.m. on on Sunday note it includes the Coachella Valley specifically stretching down south into Imperial County all around the Salton Sea. Now this is for high temperatures up to 116 degrees. It's not just about the afternoon heat. It's also the morning lows because those overnight lows are only going to be cooling down into the upper 80s and even the low 90s for some locations. So that's not a whole lot of relief. Because of that, that's going to be increasing the potential for heat related illnesses. Take the time to make sure that you are staying hydrated to check on loved ones, family, friends, make sure they're doing okay, that your ACs are working properly because this ridge of high pressure that's in place over the desert Southwest isn't going anywhere. It is staying with us. And it's actually the placement of this ridge of high pressure that is sending us all of that monsoonal moisture. What's happening is with this clockwise flow, it's tapping down into that moisture farther south, bringing that subtropical moisture up into Southern California. And we saw it with some passing clouds today, even a thunderstorm popping up around San Gorgonio Mountain. Now, the opportunity for those storms to continue to develop does exist. More for tomorrow, Saturday, and then into Sunday once again. So with our water vapor imagery, you get a better sense of all that dry air is out of here. All of this moisture coming up from the south is what we're going to be sticking with as we head into tomorrow and then again through the weekend. So dew point temperature is really going to be staying above 50 degrees as we head through Friday, dropping down into the 40s at times when we get more sunshine uh, overhead, helping to dry things out. But overall, it's a very similar setup. We're looking at our dew points in the 50s. And if you're new here to the Coachella Valley and you're saying, what is a dew point? Just know that the lower the number, the drier it is. Here in the Coachella Valley, we like to see those numbers below 50 degrees or less. Really, we're going to be hanging out in the 50s, though. That feels pretty humid by our standards out here. Evaporative coolers are not going to be efficient. Our first alert comfort air seven day forecast keeps that first alert weather alert in place through Sunday because of that excessive heat warning. And again, also the potential for some of those thunderstorms to pop up over the mountains, the high desert, and John will be feeling those humid conditions. Okay, yeah, we're in we're in the thick of it now. Thank you, Haley.